Xpeng X3 Flying Car Chinese automaker Xpeng has updated the design of its Aero HT flying car. Traffic jams are the bane of any commuter. Many of us spend an hour or so stuck in traffic every week. One solution is to create a new type of transportation that doesn't rely on roads, one that could one day make traffic jams a relic of the past. To do this, we must look to the sky. This new technology car is on another level right isn't it? Chinese manufactured this car with the ability to fly and you can drive in the fly. A luxury electric sportster with a fold-out vertical lift octocopter system on the roof. It looks absolutely nutty, but a two-ton flying prototype indicates this is no joke. The Converse e bike The Converse bike is a unique electric bicycle that features a long tail design, which allows it to convert into a cargo bike in seconds. The rear wheel of the bike can be extended out to create a sturdy platform that can support up to 132 pounds of cargo. Its purpose is to provide a convenient and efficient mode of transportation for people who need to carry both themselves and their belongings around the city. Riding in a bike can provide many health benefits, including improved cardiovascular health, increased endurance, and reduced stress levels. Auto Fuel Auto fuel refers to a system that automatically fills up the fuel tank of a vehicle. This technology is primarily used in aviation, where it is called an automatic refueling system. The system consists of a fuel pump, a control system, and various sensors that monitor the fuel levels and pressure. In aviation, the automatic refueling system allows for quick and efficient refueling of aircraft, as it eliminates the need for manual filling of the fuel tank. This system is also safer than manual refueling, as it minimizes the risk of spillage and reduces the chance of fire or explosion. Bluebird K7 Bluebird K7 is a jet-powered hydroplane that was built in the UK. The Bluebird K7 is a hydroplane boat that was designed for the purpose of setting water speed records. Specifically, it was built to break the world water speed record on Lake Mead in Nevada. Bluebird K7 is capable of reaching speeds of over 300 miles per hour, which makes it one of the fastest watercraft in the world. Bluebird K7 has a unique hydroplane design that allows it to glide over the surface of the water and reduces drag which helps to increase its speed. Jumping Lowrider A lowrider is a type of car that has been modified to have a lowered body, often with hydraulic or airbag suspension systems that allow the car to be raised or lowered at the owner's discretion. Jumping a lowrider refers to the act of using the hydraulics or airbags to make the car jump off the ground, usually in a controlled and deliberate manner. Jumping a lowrider can be a dangerous activity if not done correctly. It requires a lot of skill and experience to control the car's movements and prevent it from flipping or causing damage. It is also important to ensure that the car is properly maintained and that the hydraulic or airbag systems are in good working order to prevent accidents. SkyDrive SkyDrive is a Japanese company that specializes in developing and producing electric vertical takeoff and landing EVTOL, vehicles. Their flagship EVTOL is called the SD-03, which is a single-seat aircraft designed for urban air mobility. The SD-03 is equipped with eight rotors that allow it to take off and land vertically, without the need for a runway. The aircraft is powered by an electric motor, which makes it environmentally friendly and quiet. SkyDrive plans to offer the SD-03 as a transportation option for individuals who need to get around cities quickly and efficiently. Hyundai Elevate Project 
The Hyundai Elevate project is an innovative concept vehicle that was first unveiled at the Consumer Electronics Show. It is a walking car that combines the versatility of a traditional vehicle with the mobility of a robot. The Elevate is designed to be able to traverse difficult terrain, including rocky landscapes, steep inclines, and even stairs, thanks to its unique robotic legs. The Elevate is envisioned as a rescue vehicle capable of reaching people in remote or inaccessible locations. It could also be used for other purposes, such as delivering goods to places that are difficult to access, or as a mobility solution for people with disabilities. Note Air and Jets Note Air is also known for its autonomous transport technology. Florida-based company Note Air has announced its collaboration with JetX to build a new type of aircraft employing the former's modular transportation system and JetX's vector thrust propulsion. This can entail changing the configuration of the seats, the amount of cargo space, or even the fuselage's design. Opener Blackfly Evtol the Opener Blackfly is an electric vertical takeoff and landing EVTOL, aircraft designed and manufactured by Opener, a Canadian aerospace company. The Blackfly is a single-seat personal aerial vehicle that can take off and land vertically, making it well-suited for urban transportation. Its purpose is to provide a safe, affordable, and environmentally friendly mode of transportation that is accessible to everyone. The Blackfly is designed to operate in urban and suburban environments, with a range of up to 25 miles and a top speed of 80 miles per hour. It represents a significant step forward in the development of electric and autonomous vehicles and could ultimately help to reduce traffic congestion, improve air quality, and make our cities more livable. The Hover Coupe the Hovercoupe is a retro-style curvy hybrid electric aircraft. The hybrid electric vertical takeoff and landing VTOL, aircraft can fit in a parking space, holds two passengers, looks very much like a futuristic car-slash-aircraft with four duct-stylized fans at each corner of the aircraft. The aircraft looks like a car with its wheels replaced by duct fans. As the name suggests, it uses hover power to lift off the ground, more specifically, for small turbine engines located in the four corners of the vehicle. They are mounted on an extremely light carbon body structure. As you can imagine, the hover coupe is just a design exercise. But it's one that allows us to fantasize about a flying car future. <laughs>